This is an open letter to Th uh, James Thatcher, the brand manager of Procter & Gamble, who owns Always. Dear Mr. Thatcher, I have been a loyal user of your Always Maxi Pads for 20 years, and I appreciate many of their features. Why, without the leak guard core or the dry weave absorbency, I'd probably never go horseback riding or salsa dancing, and I'd certainly steer clear of running up and down the beach in tight white shorts. But my favorite feature has to be your revolutionary flexi wings. Kudos on being the only company smart enough to realize how crucial it is to ha that maxi pads be aerodynamic. It's I can't tell you how safe I feel knowing that each month there's a little F-16 in my pants. Have you ever had a menstrual period, Mr. Thatcher? Have you ever suffered from the curse? I'm guessing you haven't. Well, my time of the month is starting right now. As I type, I can already feel hormonal forces violently surging through my body. Just a few minutes from now, my body will adjust and I will transform into what my husband likes to call an inbred hillbilly with knife skills. Isn't the human body amazing? As brand manager in the feminine hygiene division, you've no doubt seen quite a bit of research on what exactly happens during your customer's monthly visits from Aunt Flo. Therefore, you must know about the bloating, puffiness, and cramping we endure, and all about our intense mood swings, crying jags, and out of control behavior. You surely realize it's a tough time for most women. I mean, you know, just last week, my friend Jennifer fought the violent urge to shove her boyfriend's testicles through a George Foreman grill just because he told her that he thought Grey's Anatomy was written by drunken chimps. Crazy! The point is, sir, that you of all people must realize that America is just crawling with homicidal maniacs in capri pants. Which brings me to the point for my letter. Last month, while in the throes of cramping, so painful I wanted to reach inside my body and yank out my uterus, I opened an always maxi pad. Printed there on the adhesive backing were the words, Have a happy period. Are you fucking kidding me? I, what I mean is, does any part of your tiny middle management brain really think that happiness, actual smiling, laughing happiness, is possible during a menstrual period. Did anything mentioned above sound the least bit pleasurable? Well, did it, James? FYI, unless you're kind of some kind of sick S&M freak girl, there will never be anything happy about a day in which you have to jack yourself up on Motrin and Kahlua and lock yourself in your house just so you don't march down to the local Walgreens armed with your <laughs> hunting rifle and a sketchy print land to end your life in a blaze of glory. For the love of God, man, pull your head out your ass. If you just have to slap a moronic message on a maxi pad, wouldn't it make a little bit more sense to put it something like, put down the hammer, or vehicular manslaughter is wrong. Just, are you just picking on us? Sir, please inform your accounting department that, effective immediately, there will be an $8 drop in monthly profits, for I have chosen to pay, take my MaxiPad business elsewhere. And even though I will certainly miss your flexi wings and the 747 in my pants, I will not for one minute miss your brand of condescending bullshit. And that's a promise I will keep always. Your best, Wendy Ahrens from Austin, Texas.